Hello, all you space engineers out there. Commander Kingfish here, and it is day 59 here on the frozen rock. And we are starting to get the server room just about done. Uh, I did run into a problem with uh, trying to set up my cameras. Now, I think there's a cut, might be a couple of problems. I don't know if it's just because this is on a separate grid, but we're connected with the power lines. I don't know if that's the problem. Or the other problem that I just kind of realized, I don't have an antenna or anything set up here. So uh, it is, uh, I think that might be the problem. As you can hear, I got the uh, neighbor's dog outside the door here. And I'm guessing because Commander Butts is probably sitting over at the door, uh, the dog sees her, so we'll see. Uh, anyway, that's just a little bit of rambling here on the road. All right, so I think what I'm going to try first, and it's something I need to do anyway, is to set up an antenna. And I want to do that with... Uh, uh, a large panel. Hold on just a second. I'll be right back. All right, I am back. I hopefully we've got everything settled down around here. Uh, now, I was going to do... This is what I'm thinking of. Uh, let me uh, get into here. Electronics board... Where is it? It's one of the mod. Yeah, it's this one right here, electronics panel. So what I want to do, we can put that right there, I guess. And let's see, I think it needs to turn like that. I need construction components. So let's go get some construction components. I'll tell you what, let me get the construction of components and I'll be right back. All right, I think I have all of my parts, I hope. So we're gonna put a electronics panel right here. And then the idea of this electronics panel is that you don't have to put a big old antenna somewhere. So the next thing we're going to do is go 7, and I am going to put, say, a, do something like that. Let's, uh, I want to rotate it. Oh. like that, put that right there, and then I think I need a remote. I think we'll put that right by it. Oh, I can't, I can't put a remote on the electronics panel? Oh, shoot. All right, well, I guess we'll put it right there. All right, means I'm gonna have to go get more parts, but let's do this so we can put this right there. And then, oh, I do have enough stuff for the remote. That's good. Okay. Now, I might need to do that on the other, but let's see if we manage to, to get this to, to work. All right, so I want to go to G and cargo camera. 
camera refinery. Let me pull this down. And I want to view it. Well, that didn't do anything. Let's do this first. Okay. Let's, uh... Uh... Let's go here. Control panel. Uh... Let's make sure our remote is turned on. It is. And... Autopilot, collision avoidance, cameras. Okay, let's see if that does anything. I'm just flying by the seat of my pants here, so I'm trying to figure some stuff out. Uh, if this doesn't do anything, let's go two, no. All right, well, I tell you what, I'm gonna play around with this a little bit more, and if I can get this working, I will uh, catch back up with you all here in just a little bit. Well, I think I have kind of somewhat solved the problem a little bit. <clears throat> I, uh, so what I did was I've disconnected this, the coal plant, from the main grid. And so now, and I also figured out that I couldn't use the uh, mod that would allow me to put a small grid antenna in. I had to put a large antenna in. Or I'm pretty sure that that was the case. Uh, so we are disconnected here and I have the remote and then I have a battery and then this is the coal plant which should be continually generating power uh, so I'm fine over here I'm just not getting this power going over to the base now because I've got it disconnected but for testing purposes let's go back over to the base and we should be able to, well, if I hop on here, I can also show you that for the remote access, I have the cargo truck, which I'm on. I have the coal plant, which I'm on. And then I have the underground base, but it's showing the controller uh, not having a antenna. And when I had disconnected the, or when I connected the power grid back into this base here, it was showing it a controller. So I think what I need to do is go back over here. I need to turn that gold rock off too. I didn't, uh, forgot to do that. But let's get back over to the base. Let's see what we can do here. Uh, I actually may have to build an antenna over here. Which I can do. Uh, just going to take a little bit. I think what I need to do is... Uh, a little hard to navigate here in, in the fog. Tipping over. There we go. Alright, let's park this and get out of here. Now, I should be able to... Well, let's go downstairs first and see what, uh, what, we're, what we can see here. I still may not be able to... Well, actually, I might be able to. Because I have already connected into 
the camera on my cargo truck. So if we go over here and we hop onto here, we should see. Uh, I still got the one camera into the medical bay, which we're seeing right here. Now, if I do uh, remote access, I should see the cargo truck. So if we uh, control this, I've already set up a uh, camera on the back of it. So if we do there, we can look out the back of the cargo truck. All right. And now let's do this. Let's uh, go into remote access and let's go to the coal plant. We want to control it. And I think we got to do this. All right. Uh, shoot. Okay, let's do this again. Let's go into remote access and let's go to the control plant and so we've got a empty control panel down below if we hit G we should see the coal camera we can drop it down and go to view and if we do this and if we hit one this is what the view is here in the coal plant uh, so you can see that the idea is working. My whole problem is uh, get out of here. Let's get uh, back to the underground base and top out of here. There we go. We're back at the underground base. So, I don't necessarily want to have uh, the coal plant disconnected from this base. Alright? So, I've got to figure out if I can connect that up. Otherwise, my idea of surveillance isn't going to work. Everything else has been working pretty good all along. So, let me do just a couple of more things here. Let me put in a full-blown antenna here. Obviously, this is not doing what I want it to do. So let's go ahead and take this out. Ah, I did not want to do that. All right. Uh, I need concrete. Of course I need concrete. All right. So let me do a couple of more things around here. I see I need to get some more food as well. So uh, I'll get back with you here in just a little bit. And then I think it'll be about time to start wrapping the video up. Well, we didn't get as much done today as I was hoping to get done. I was kind of hoping to get the remotes all totally figured out. I think I got it partially figured out. I think it has to do with how the uh, how I have the bases all connected with the power grids, and that's how I'm powering the base. Uh, I am not sure if I'm going to be able to fully have the base set up with uh, remote controls and be able to view my cameras. Uh, I tried another trick here and when I had the full-blown antenna out there on the coal plant and I had it hooked into the base it was showing the base remote uh, as uh, active and uh, functioning but now that I've tried now that I have tried to put an antenna in here I wanted to put it down here I guess I'm going to have to put a full-blown antenna up above. Uh, I put this compact antenna in, and it didn't seem to do it. Now, I don't know if that means that it, the remote is just not reading 
that uh, as an antenna uh, and so maybe I can't use it uh, it's gonna have to be just a regular antenna and so I'll do that the next time around but uh, running out of time today and uh, yeah so partially got the remotes figured out partially not and that's what we're uh, we'll deal with in the next uh, video and then uh, uh, try to pretty much call this uh, control room done and then figure out what we need to do from there. Uh, that will pretty much have the underground base uh, completed and uh, then I think it might be time to start looking at seeing if we can't get to space and if we can do that then we might be getting close to calling this season done because I would like to move on to some other stuff and do some other things uh, and uh, kind of close this season out so we've been at it for well over a year now and so I think it's time to start getting this thing wrapped up all right all you space engineers out there keep building away and uh, if you like this video please hit the thumbs up on it it really helps the video out a lot and if you like the channel please subscribe that really helps the channel out a lot all right, well, with that, Commander Kingfish is out of here, and I will see you all in the next video. Thanks for watching, everyone.